And the most common problem that we have in our throwers, infield and outfield, is they don't do a good job of setting up their arm circle correctly. So make sure when you go ahead and you throw either a larger arm circle as an outfielder or more of an oval like an infielder, your wrist position is very, very important. So we've broken down a drill to make sure that the fielders are in the proper launching position when they're throwing the softball. Let's go ahead and take a look at our players right now, just working on a drill to put the hand position in the proper angle by touching the fence with the ball. The most common problem with youth high school level players and even some college players is that they throw the ball with the ball facing the target the entire time. So instead of throwing a nice oval, they throw more of a V or a pie at the target. So it would look something like this if the camera was the target, they come back and they have the ball facing the target the entire time and throw like it's a pie. And if you were to draw a line, it looks like a V. Instead of being able to turn that ball around and be in a nice launching position, bend in the elbow and a bend in the wrist. The key is to be able to have that wrist snap, have that thumb underneath the ball and actually wrist snap as the ball releases off the fingers and you wrist snap with your palm down. As coaches, when you're watching your players, see how many players finish with their wrist down versus wrist out or wrist in. That's a red flag that you want to work on, and we're going to go ahead and show you some drills to help with the wrist snap right now. Let's take a look. They've set up in their ready position. They've got the ball nice and high, and notice that they have the back of their hand facing themselves. The ball is away from their, their head. And they're going to go ahead and work on a nice wrist snap by tapping on the fence that we know that the hand wrist position is correct. You'll notice that the glove elbow is pointing at their target. They're relaxed. And now in slow motion, they'll go ahead and tap, tap in slow motion, work on the upper body part of their throw. Right now, you'll go ahead and do it. Watch how they go ahead and drive that glove arm in to help with rotation on the throw. They'll go ahead and do it again. Tap, tap, tap. We know that we've got a good wrist snap, nice launching position, and they work on following through, snapping that wrist with palm down when they throw that ball. Let's go ahead and see it one more time. Okay, 